Struck that a little bit because you went a lot of places. I noticed you started out kind of easy, yeah. eased into it, and you built it up. And we were talking a little bit about dynamics. That's, that's a go. big D. And if you're doing any performing, you can you're going to find out that dynamics are a big part of, of the show. You know, whether it's the band or a player, or and if you don't play or sing with dynamics, it's just kind of flatlines. Yeah, and boring. You know. And songs, you know, songs usually have if if you're really paying attention to a song, they have that kind of built in it. You know, you yeah. you're doing the verse, you kind of saying it, but once you hit that chorus, man, you need to you need bump to it pump it up a little bit. Yeah, yeah, bump it up. And, and then that's I know what it's all about. And then the last verse, you kind of you kind of went yeah. up and, 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 and we're flying high for a while. Put a little bit of your own thing in there. Right, right. I heard a little. You know, uh, ah, little, ah, all yeah, that yeah. kind of stuff. But uh, I'm glad it's working today. Let me uh, let me sort of just for the sake of of, of learning here. Um, kind of deconstruct that song a little bit. So we started out with just kind of, you know. And so that, that, that to me is really revealing in terms of how a, you're serving the song in the sense that, yeah, you're right. It does have a built-in dynamic. The song was written yeah. that way. And, it, and, and when you're singing, the, the lyrics are telling the story. Yeah. And depending on how you approach the song and sing it, yeah. you're gonna, people are going to understand the story or they're not going to understand it. And, you know, yeah. I was thinking in terms of the clarity with which you delivered those words. I heard every word you sang. Hey, you know, you know I, there was no guesswork there. Enunciation, e, excuse me, enunciation is extremely important. I can't stand, uh, you know, as much as I love Michael Jackson, it used to make me so doggone mad <laughs> that I wouldn't understand what he was saying until he got to the chorus. I'm like, what's the rest of the stuff? There's a lot of there's a lot of artists like that, you know. I mean, don't get me wrong. Now, I love Michael Jackson to death. You kidding me? Uh, but you have to understand what people are saying, and you know, there's there's a lot of songs that are out now that the verse means nothing. It's all mm -hmm. chorus. Mm -hmm. It's all about the hook. That's what they say. Yeah. It's the hook over and over and over. That's what people say. But I want to understand. I want to know what the story's about. Yeah, it could be saying absolutely nothing. And you get to the hook, and you got this cool thing going on, and that's the only part you like in the song. The song, the song has a verse, it has a chorus, it's got a bridge. All of those things mean something in the song. 